<laughs> yeah, it's been a while since I've done this. Yeah, welcome back everyone, my name is Big Zero. And you can see I'm back here with more uh, Xenoverse 2. And with the recent free update for the DLC, we've actually gotten access to uh, Beast Gohan's transformation. In this game, just known as Beast. And I kind of wanted to show it off, just like how ridiculous the power gap could be between something like uh, Super Saiyan got to, uh, Blue Evolution and some and basically just being like beast because it, it finally gives you unique combo strings and I just kind of want to show it off but first let's just kind of like show off like all the skills I have I have changed it a little bit from my initial move set uh, focusing on stuff like soaring fist just to hurry up and kind of like mimic just like the whole punch of like oh just the air pressure is hitting you uh, wild buster as like a Russian attack do all that basic Kamehameha you know how it is, it's a very good skill. Dragon Fist for when we use part of the beast combo. And Warp Kamehameha if they somehow survive like all of that. Basically like at the very end of the beast combo, you te teleport in and finish them off. And it can really do like an obscene amount of damage, especially when you have this soul for Topo God Destruction, where it boosts like all the strength you do by, by double XL. Sure, you take more damage and your key recovers super slowly. Actually, now that I think about it, I just change ultimate charge to burst charge. Because with burst charge, it'll actually just be a better skill overall to, like, all right, here, get your skill up right away because you'll see when we do it. Anyways, with that, let's head into the lab. All right, here we go. Back into the lab. It's actually been a while since I've been here. I really recently only really hopped back in the game just to get Beast, the Beast skill. And in case you're wondering how you get it, you have to max out friendship with Gohan, Videl, and Piccolo in order to get it. And it does, and then you get a special training mission with Piccolo to unlock the ability to sell max. It's not hard, uh, but ultimately it's not really anything you want to worry about. Anyways, let's just kind of like show this off to see all the damage. Uh, let's just do like a fully charged combat on the map. Yeah, sure, it's up close, but you do about 7,000 with the Topo Super Soul. And let's just do that at... Let's just do the... The strongest combo that a male state has. The YXY. Resulting in about 6,000 damage. So... Now let's show off this. The Beast Transformation. In order to transform this, like it showed earlier, you need 5 key uh, bars to do it. But, unlike other transformations, it actually takes your key to transform. So like Super Saiyan, you need three key bars to transform, and you keep the three key bars, but you don't here. So in this case, let's do our YXY again, and show off the damage. Yeah, it goes from like 6,000 to 8,000. And a fully charged Kamehameha, doing 8,561. Now, and you have noticed here, even though I'm a Saiyan, it does not cause you to teleport because this is a universal transformation and thus it's not like a Super Saiyan transformation where you get the warp-like effect. So let's just again show off the new transforming combo that works for like every race. The Y, X, and then you do the combo that Gohan does against Cell Map. And it does do an impressive amount of damage, being almost 11,000 with this build. But you can only sometimes do it. So if you do like the X and try to follow up with after that, it doesn't work as you can see here. But it can to an extent. You do X and it doesn't work there. But if you say you do, yeah, it see even if you start off with X, it doesn't work. It can with other races like the female Saiyan and the female Earthling. I know that for a fact. I haven't tried it with the Freezer race or the Mechian, so I wouldn't know off the top of my head. But if you start off with Y, you can see here that you can actually pull off the combo, and it actually does do slightly more damage. It's not super important, but it's like, yeah, you can do it. But it also gives everyone a universal um, stamina break to kind of go off, because you do this. And there, you get a universal stamina break. Uh, only problem is, well, if you try to do this online, it's not going to fully connect. Anyways, though, but you can also use it to go into other combos. In this case, connect that into Dragon Fist and watch the damage just shoot up. 
basically if you pull that off, it's essentially a one-hit kill with this build specifically. And it can't combo with like a whole bunch of skills. Like if you try to do warp coming on and on, it won't work. However, if we were to go back and let me show you a different skill with it, if you do it with Kaioken coming on, it's essentially I'm doing the same damage as the no, it's doing more damage. Because as a key blast super, even with the same, it's more powerful. So, anyways, like that, uh, showing off all the skills. Let's actually head in and prove in some matches to see just how powerful the beast can be.
Yeah.